gonna get close to this guy to kill him without getting hit. Okay. We killed him and got close close to getting hit. Um, there's this guy for the two blue hearts. What's over here? Oh my gosh, and it is the mushroom. It is the mushroom that gives us five... Five, uh, effect prom. How much cooldown? Is it 10% cooldown, which would put us up to 395? I have to get it. I have to Yo, 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 everybody, what's going on? It's Lodis here, back with another Nordic Ashes run. Hopefully, y'all have been enjoying the content. If so, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. And if you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Every little bit counts, and I do greatly appreciate it. Without further ado, we're going to jump right on into this. We're going to play some Helga this run, and we're going to see how that goes. Um, should be pretty interesting. Uh, we are going to go Book of Stars into Tarot Deck, since it's been a while since we've done Tarot Deck. But... Uh, we're not able to kick it off with tarot deck, so... Because tarot deck, I feel like, is just not that good um, right out the gate. So, we're going to jump right in. We're going to try this out, see how things go. I don't think I'm going to... I don't think it's going to go too bad. Um, but yeah, the main reason was because we haven't... Uh, we haven't ran tarot deck in a little while, so I do want to run that. But also, uh, on top of that... Um, like, like I said, the last time we ran tarot deck, like, it, we died, like, pretty quick because it just wasn't, uh, it just wasn't that good. So, hopefully, hopefully this time things are a little different. I am gonna wait a little bit till we spend some money. I'll grab that. Why not? That'll, that'll help. The, uh, the boomerang will help in the process of us trying to, um, save up some XP to work toward getting, uh, tarot deck and whatnot, so... Should be pretty good. Pretty good there. Um, I'll take a red heart container. Why not? So, yeah. Let's let's work our way over here now. So, projectile speed actually could be pretty good. But the problem is... We're not running any projectiles, really. Cooldown, that'll be huge. Area, sure. And then... Tarot deck, we'll get. And I'll immediately ascend that. Uh, the dead is super good. So, hopefully we can get a good, good amount of that. Uh, with this, I think we want damage. I mean, we, we technically want all of them. Damage, cooldown, and effect prob. So I'm kind of okay with whatever we get there. Um, probably throw it into XP as well. Just to get uh, that up and running. But we should, be, we should be pretty good. I'm not really too worried. Uh, now that we got uh, a good amount of points into tarot deck, we should be, we should be looking pretty good. Okay. As long as we stop getting, um, like, the boost and the cure and stuff, the dead is huge. Doesn't kill the elites, but that's that's okay. Alright. The wound, I believe, gives, like, a bleeding to it. I'm assuming. I'm not sure, though. Once again, if we can get, like, three or four hundred seedlings, like, that'll put us in a really good spot. Um, other than that, I mean, we're just gonna go with the flow and see what we can get happening here. We're up to 42 gold already, which is actually pretty crazy. Uh, I'll take the plus one damage. That'll help, uh, I think, the Book of Stars, but other than that, I don't think it's gonna help a whole lot. Uh, chance to poison? Sure. I'll take it, I guess. I'll take it, I guess. Uh, I'll get this. Um, yeah, I'll take that. I mean, 30 effect, 30 percent effect props. I mean, not super great, um, but we could try and dump a load of um, points into like a like an effect prob when we go and see Talkor and stuff. Try and uh, roll to get as much effect prob as possible, because right now we're at negative two. We're at negative 2.5 percent. So is is that? regards to yep it's regards to that cooldown potion i figured as much so yeah we we definitely need to get more effect prob um even if it's not like even if it's like 10 20 30 percent that'll bump it up to like i think like 60 percent for uh the rest of our um stuff going on so i think at a bare minimum at least work towards doing that so we'll see though 
We'll see, though. I mean, right now we're not doing too bad. Um, I'm not. I'm not really too too worried with Helga. But I mean, we are running Pharaoh deck, so I'd say anything could change with tarot deck, so hopefully hopefully we can make some good progress. I do like the dead card an awful lot. So, hopefully we can draw them a lot. Because it, it just it does 999 damage, kills everything on the screen, and it's just, it's absolutely phenomenal. Like, you can't you can't go wrong with it. Okay. So we have cooldown, shrine, and attack speed. Which isn't too bad. Attack speed will only be good for like the Book of Stars. The rest, not, not so much. Um, I might. I don't know. I may take either Ace or Air. I'm not sure which one I'm gonna take yet. Um, if we even make enough XP to take one of them, we'll see though. Oh crap! We picked up an experience ring. Cool. I didn't even see that until I looked up at the map and I saw that we had the poison uh, card city on the map. I was like, oh snap. I wonder what we picked up, and I saw that we had the XP ring down there, so that's pretty pretty nice. Um, let's roll some more into this guy. I mean, we could go duration for, like, burn and, uh... The burn and poison. In the frozen aspect of it. I mean, we don't have a whole lot of, uh... Enemies accumulating on the map right now, so let's see how well that actually goes. So I would say the cards, the tarot deck is definitely a lot better if you can get, uh, if you can get a lot of, uh, monsters on the map. Ooh, that like that that was a good one. Okay. I mean, we are getting to the point where we're almost having ninety nine gold every every run on every wave, which is pretty pretty sweet. So we are up to seven point five percent. I don't know. Where that comes into play if we pick something up or something or I don't remember picking anything up, but thing and who knows. So basically we want charming fungus, um, lucky shroom, lucky mushroom, or effect prob from talk or are like the ones we're looking for, and then of course the ring from you know, picking up just a standard ring. So, I think I think we'll do okay. Um, I think we should be able to get all that. Not looking too bad. So, should be should be good. Should be good. Okay, here's this boss. I'll pop this. Um, oh, there's actually a lot more XP on the ground than I thought there was going to be. Interesting. Okay, I didn't think there was going to be that much XP on the ground. Um, sweet. So we got that. Let's pick this up, I guess. We'll throw more into this. We'll roll. See if we can get more, yeah, more projectiles on it. I'm all in on projectiles. Uh, I'll take damage there. And yeah, damage and cooldown for that one because we definitely we definitely need it. Um, as uh, we definitely need it because our um, damage on Book of Stars is very low. Very very low. So I'll definitely take that. I wonder if you were to get the ring for Lifts All Immunity, how that would go against uh, the bosses where they're immune to like all your uh, like skills and stuff. Because like this guy, well, he's not immune to the poison, but he's immune to the dead. So I'm curious, what if you were to take um, the ring? Would it cancel out so you could use the dead on the bosses? Oh, snap. I 
have to take it. Area, I don't think area and projectiles is gonna be worth it. 50 gold? Oh. Let's see if I can try and spend it enough so I don't waste any. Duration, critical, projectiles. Yeah, I'll take projectiles. One full red heart container. Oh man, we're gonna waste some gold. Actually, no, we're not. Whew. Whew. That's good. Oh my gosh, and we got the golden Noki. Okay, so we have to take this one. Spec prob, yes. Movement speed, sure. Roll. Um. Damage area. I'll take the empty red heart container. I'll roll. I need more effect prob. Take cooldown. More effect prob. I mean, that doesn't really matter for me. I guess I'll take it. Alright, so we're sitting okay. Um, I am going to use one of the things here to get draw two. Um, I will bounce this up, these up. Oh, I'll, I'll actually level this up to get uh, this as well. Um, and then projectile. I mean, sure, we could level up projectile. Not that that's going to matter a whole lot, I don't think. Um, but then we'll keep the uh, last ascension crystal to get that uh, stuff on the road. And then we also have this cooldown shrine, which will probably pop up a good amount as well. So we're good there. And we have the golden Noki, so like, there's there's definitely a high chance that we'll end up maxing out. Um, we'll end up definitely maxing out our gold. Like, I don't see a world that we don't right now. Especially with Helga. Like, I feel like Helga's... Helga's one that <clears throat> can really uh, prosper from getting... Uh, like, by washing... Washing out. By uh, wiping out all the uh, crates and seedlings and stuff on the map. So, like, there's a pretty high chance that we'll definitely... <clears throat> definitely cap out on gold. Okay... Oh, and we got to... Oh my god, dude. Our cooldown is going to be freaking insane. Like, plus 50% on our cooldown. Our cooldown is already 210. So this would bump it up to 260. When we get the next uh, the next uh, Ascension Crystal, that'll be over 360%. 360% cooldown. That is insane. That is insane. Oh, that really threw me for a loop there, trying to... Yeah, we got hit. Bit of a bummer. But it threw me for a loop when uh, I was trying to uh, dash around and avoid it. Okay. Should get this here. Hopefully, a lot going on. We got six points. Um, I think I'm going to take... Air. Mainly because they can fly around me closely. Um, Ace is good if we can get the uh, chain reaction, which we're not spending any ascension crystals, so Ace would be a little bit of a downfall for us. So that's why I didn't go with Ace. Uh, um, of course, the more cooldown we can get, the better uh, like we'll be able to spawn more cards. So we're looking good there. Okay. What is this? Two blue hearts? I don't know if that's really worth it. Like, if they're red hearts, then yes, but two blue hearts? I don't I don't think that's really worth it, to be honest with you. Because if we get hit, we, we lose them. Okay, shock. I do want to get the gold, though. Okay. Still looking super good. What do we got here? Another dash? Um, I, th I think I could take that. It'd be okay. Oh, yeah, that was a good one. That was a really good one. Oh, my gosh. Okay. The dead is by far the absolute best card. Boom. 
Too easy, dude. Our effect prob is up to 12.5%. Not very high, but uh, on top of the 30% we have for the tarot deck, or 45%, so we got 40, 57.5%. 57.5%, that's not too bad. And we are hitting, I would say, most of the time. So we're good there. So much XP, man. And of course, I'm going to keep going into, like, effect prob um, and cool down. To get as much of that as we can. Um, what else? I'd say maybe damage. Because damage would increase, like, your poison, your, your burn, air... Um, so maybe go that route, would be my guess. Um, other than that, I don't really know what else I would go for. Okay. Should be able to wipe this guy out pretty quick. Yep, sure did. Okay, we got a crate here. Let's see what we got. Pull down, crit. Let's go projectiles. Those guys will help us a quite a bit. Or they have been helping us quite a bit, I feel like. Okay. I mean, we're only at 36 gold, which isn't that good. We're almost through the wave. But then again, we haven't been uh, running around and getting as many crates as uh, I would like. Either, so... Try and get a, try and get a few more crates going here. You got five gold up there, so I'm gonna run back up there and try and pick up that five gold. Okay, wipe you out. Dash up here. There's two gold. Run up here. Try and pick up this other five gold here. I mean, we're up to 44. This put us up to 40. Okay, there's seven gold. 52. Alright, I mean we're looking we're looking okay. Guess we'll run over here. Okay. I don't know what I think I dodged it in a way. Okay, so far. Oh, snappers. Okay. Alright, still looking okay. Okay, we wipe her out. Sweet. Sweet! That was a little, little worrisome. We're up to 370% cooldown. I'm gonna pick the ring up. I'm gonna pick up XP attraction. More gold there. I'm gonna run over here, see if we can see if we can get more gold. Okay. Uh, we got an effect prob. I'll definitely take that. Um, one damage plus ten attack speed. I don't think that'll be worth it for us. Um, I'll, I will take damage, even though it's only like five percent or three percent or something. I'm gonna roll past all of the- oh, there's gold there, I should've took the gold, crap. I really need to look up top there to make sure that it doesn't pop up. 10 on cooldown. So we're up to 385%. Oh my god, no! If I took that gold, we would've had this. Which would've bumped us up to 420%. Like oh my god, why? That'd be insane. Okay, let's let's max air out. Uh, yeah, that works. Let's do projectile speed. Uh, let's get you. Let's get you. Okay, looking good. 
looking good. Oh my gosh, that is insane. I really do want to try and get to, um... I mean, of course, if we can get the gold, it'll bump us all the way up to, um... Holy cow. Our cooldown is so high, look at the Book of Stars. Like, it's just, like, zooming around. So cooldown with Book of Stars is really good. Okay. I'm trying to get close to this guy to kill him without getting hit. Okay. We killed him and got close close to getting hit. Um, there's this guy for the two blue hearts. What's over here? Oh my gosh, and it is the mushroom. It is the mushroom that gives us five... Five uh, effect problem. How much cooldown? Is it 10% cooldown, which would put us up to 395? I have to get it. I have to get it. Like, that is so worth it. That is so worth it. And it gives us... And it gives us... 10% damage. Which, I mean... We lose some. But I'll take it, because we should be able to get that 10% damage back fairly quickly by picking up the gold. Like, we're already back up to 2%. So, 4% here, 5%, and then if we come up here to the mine, yeah, we're already back over. So, like, yeah, we picked it up. Like, um, we went to, uh, yeah, we picked up the Charming Fungus. And we lost 10% damage, but we got that damage back really quick. Like, we're already at 29%. And we're at 395 cooldown, which is insane. I do want to get 400% cool, over 400% cooldown for the title. That'd be pretty sick. Okay. 36... Oh, there's a chest up here. Dude, the dead card is so good. Let's just go damage for that. And then, oh my gosh. And then with the monolith? Oh my goodness, dude. We're gonna be... I, I need to see. I need to see. So if we get this... Now we run. Okay, there's gold right here. I can't say no to the gold. Then we run over this direction. Hopefully, we can get enough leaves out of all these runs. So by the time we get back to Axeldor, we can buy the plus 250 or buy the 99 plus uh, gold upgrade. So then we can get up to 250 gold. So let's see. Four. That gives us a hundred percent. 495 cooldown. Oh my god. Oh my god. 495% cooldown. That is insane. Oh my god. That is crazy. Okay, um, like, I'm trying to run around and pick up all the gold, but I'm also, like, trying to find crates to break to get more gold as well. Three, 495 cooldown. That is insane. Okay. Um, is there gold in there? Cool down, cool down. Uh, cool down. Alright. So we're up to 420% cooldown. We would be at 520 if we got, uh, whatchamacallit, but that's okay. And then we pop this. 
Oh, we got hit, dang it. That's alright. Broke and Sindri down, baby. Easy peasy. Yo, if y'all ended up enjoying this, make sure you guys tap that like button down below. If you guys are new to the channel, don't forget to subscribe. Every little bit counts, and I do greatly appreciate it. Um, you guys can also ding that notification bell to uh, get notified when a new video goes live, as I do upload every single day, and you guys don't want to miss out. But uh, yeah, that was been uh, that was Helga, so that was that was always pretty fun. So uh, every non-red half heart grants one percent damage. Oh, interesting. But yeah. Hopefully y'all enjoyed. Next episode we'll jump in and play some Takor. But um, yeah. Once again, thank you guys all for watching. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.